defers to Jacobs on the draw. And he'll be brought down, losing yardage back at the 40. Officially, it's a one-yard loss. That's going to bring up second and 11. When a draw works, it can be a thing of beauty. But when it doesn't, oh, it can be ugly. And in this case, loss of yardage ugly. Second and 11 now after the loss. Car a handoff here to Drake. And he will be brought down at about the 43 that time. Give him three yards on the run there. That still leaves him with a difficult third and eight coming up. Jacobs, and this time he is in. Josh Jacobs, excellent work there to get in on the touchdown run. And the Raiders drive right down the field and score on the opening drive. It's 7 zip Vegas. So that time in total eight plays. And it was capped off by a touchdown run from Josh Jacobs.
Following the touchdown, ready to kick it away is Carlson. Byron Pringle now to return it. And good starting field position. He'll get this one all the way up to about the 35-yard line. The KC offense set to go, led as always, by the gunslinger, a former MVP in this league, it's Patrick Mahomes. I've been told time and time again by a lot of big-time quarterback gurus that a big arm isn't even close to what they're looking for as a number one quality and, and what, what makes a key big. But let's face it, when you see a guy with a big arm, you get excited that Patrick Mahomes is that guy. Every throw in the book, he can make it. And he'll get this one up to about the 39 here. Call it a gain of four on first, and that'll make it second down. They go play fake. Mahomes. This one completes to be Cole Hardman. And he'll be taken down across the 50 at the 45 in enemy territory. It'll be a pickup of 16 and a Chiefs first down. And that's a more than acceptable read right there because it's zone coverage. So timing is everything. This time he waits for his man to come open, puts it right on him, and they pick up a first down. On first down, Mahomes. That one caught by Tyreek Hill. And he's corralled, but not before getting it inside the 35. An 11-yard pickup, and it's enough for a Chiefs first down. Well, I think when they look at their offense, they think to themselves, weapons, weapons everywhere. And they want to move the ball around. They want to spread it to different people. But you absolutely know they want to get this man involved as well. And that's what they just did on that play. Two yards on the pickup there. It'll be second and eight. Throwing now is Mahomes. And that was going to be off target and incomplete. He used to have the coaches tell us all the time. Those daily reports aren't just to use on paper, guys. Well, nowadays, you know, we're watching a computer screen, right? They scouted this team very well. We know that they like to use the running backs in the passing game. They come to that too successfully. That will be touched down here, but not before he does pick up the first. Post because officials always tell you, I don't want to throw the flag, but you caused the flag. You did it. I had to. And he will score. Touchdown, Kansas City. Mahomes fighting Tyreek Hill. And the Chiefs are an extra point away from tying up this football game. So the touchdown there, and that play, the tap pass, so simple, Charles, on the face of it, but what makes it so difficult for defenses to stop? I think it's the precision and the quickness in which the play occurs because the snap gets to the quarterback. He's essentially playing volleyball with it, just immediately just shoveling it forward. And when that receiver's at a full head of steam, if you don't take the edge away, he's got a chance to get to the corner and get upfield. But if you take the edge away, that's your chance to disrupt that play. And no disruption there, that's for sure, as it winds up six points. Each team's had it. Each team has scored. 7-7 seven, seven here as the kick's away. Jalen Richard now on the return. And he'll be stopped up at the 25. Second drive of the game coming up for this Las Vegas offense. And for them, a touchdown their last go around. Obviously, they'll be hoping to do that again. And when you start plotting for this drive, when you start thinking to yourself, okay, what are we going to do? You don't go away from what you did before because that worked. But you have to be prepared for wrinkles and counters because you know they'll make some adjustments. Drake will start the drive on the ground. And he's able to take this one up to the 35-yard line. On any explosive run, you can almost feel the ground shaking. And that's from the offensive lineman creating space for their runners. I had an old coach tell me before that he always told his runners, run around the offensive line in pregame. Get used to the ground shaking. So you don't trip and fall when it happens in a game. And he'll be brought down right around the 37. They'll get three as the drive continues. It's a first down. 
second and inches oftentimes an invitation for the offense coordinator to take a big shot downfield because he feels like he can come back on third down and pick up the first down but sometimes you just don't want to break tendency stay with what you are stay with who you know and go get the first down that's exactly what they did throwing on first down is Carr he's going deep for Brown and the defense has it covered. It's intercepted. Picked up by Javarius Ward. And the return just out across the 15 to the 16-yard line. Well, his arm strength never an issue, but this one winds up in the wrong hands. Oh, the coverage here is just terrific because when it's done really well, sometimes you can't distinguish whether it's the receiver or the defensive back the ball's intended for. He actually ran with him in perfect motion and able to make a big-time play. Mahomes will lead the Chiefs up first and 10 at their own 16. So after the INT, here's Mahomes. And it's knocked away and incomplete. Nico Hardman, the intended target, and now a second down. Yes, sir. How about an out boy there on first down? Got his hand in and knocked it away. An incomplete pass on first down. That leads to a second and ten. Mahomes going to throw. Into double coverage and it's intercepted. Picked up by Trayvon Merrick. And the return will stop right around the 25. Well, that's a drive killer right there. Not a really confident throw either. This one was kind of up for grabs, and it's going to come down the hands of the wrong team. Here's Las Vegas ready to take the field. And following the interception, we'll see what they can put together on this drive. I hear my old college coach right now. He always used to tell us before every game, the team making the fewest mistakes will win. But they're hoping is that that last mistake is their only one of the game. Coaches, that's all they talk about, turnovers, right? Minimizing those and maximizing opportunities. A run on first down with Jacobs as he'll get this forward for about four. Second and six coming up. He did have the touchdown run earlier, but not a heck of a lot more than that throughout this game. No, not at all. In fact, I would say that this defense has done as good of a job on him as they have on any runner in recent memory. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. They will run the draw with Jacobs, and he'll get this one down to about the 17. Still a couple yards short of the first as the three-yard gain brings up a third down. to run for it with Jacobs and he'll have the first down getting this one to the 14 yard line a third down gain of three yards and that'll be enough it's a pretty simple bargain you pick up the turnover set you up in the field position the last thing you want to do is go three and out in this spot yeah they would have had to settle for a field goal attempt but now they keep those touchdown hopes alive Here's a first and 10 at the 14-yard line. Carr. And this will be incomplete. Physical play on the football there, and it's second down. He did a fine job there of not hitting it before the ball arrived, and I've got to tell you, you can often mistime that play because of the angles of approach. When you're going to get him, sometimes you panic as well and think, I've got to be there right now. Instead, in this case, timed it perfectly and knocked it free. Throw right side, going to be caught by Waller. He'll get only three there, so it leaves him with a third and seven ahead. Not a big window to throw. Coverage wasn't too bad there. Yeah, they had him under wraps pretty well, but somehow able to muscle his way open and catch the ball. Throwing his car on third down. And this is going to be intercepted. Picked up by Javarius Ward. Well, they 
were in a great position to take the lead, Charles. Obviously, all they needed was a field goal to do that. They wanted the touchdown. Unfortunately, they're going to get neither. And you know every offense talks about the same thing each week, don't they, Brandon? They want to end every drive with a kick, whether it's a field goal attempt, a point after the touchdown, or worst, a punt. This time they had that opportunity but didn't get it. 